It's pretty sad that I have to start a video off like this, but there are like three people out there that just try to ruin it for everybody else. This tool was given to me by Eastwood, and uh, if you're not capable of making your own decisions on whether you need these tools or not, regardless of what I have to tell you, I suggest you don't even watch this video. That being said, let me show you what I got. All right, so for most of you who watch the channel on a regular basis, you are familiar with the Bibster. This is my top, top Fox Body hot rod that I'm building. I deem the modern day hot rod. And I'm getting ready to split the top on this thing. So basically I've narrowed this thing eight inches. So pretty, what? Picture. You got taking your picture? Uh -huh. Yeah. So what I've basically done on this thing is I've narrowed it eight inches and I have to make the top match. And I think I'm gonna do it with Daddy, the plasma. Daddy, what? What? Picture. Yeah, it takes your picture. You gonna wave? Wave. Say hey. Hey. Cheese. So I've got a new tool from Eastwood that I want to show you guys. I've been kind of holding this back. These are some things that they've sent me that I really wanted to bring to you guys and uh, this particular tool that I'm going to show you today is going to help with splitting the top on that so I've got Kanan helping me today my special guest he's going to help me open the boxes and uh, I'll show this thing to you you ready? wave hey Here. look let's open the box this one look look what Daddy's got Let's see what's in this one first. Hey. Hey. Tools. Tools. Yep. We got tools. Open You want to open it? Mm -hmm. Look, Daddy's got one too. Mm -hmm. Look, you gotta take the plastic off like this. Take it off. Tools. Tools. All right. Man, I love tools. Don't you love tools? You help daddy? Alright, so I know what you're thinking. What? what kind of tool is that? That's just a working stand that you'd use in a body shop, body panel stand, or I think uh, Eastwood calls it a heavy duty work stand, right? It folds up. That's all that is. Why is that so cool? We all have one of those, right? But that's why what I'm about to show you is cool because everybody has one of these. So Eastwood has basically developed these tables that go on top of these. They call their weld and cut stand or weld and cut tables, I believe is what they're called. And these tables will go on top of these stands that you already have that will allow you to make a plasma table uh, or a welding table out of these stands. So let's open up these other boxes and see, see what they look like, see how they work. All right, so I've basically just spared you the boringness of assembling this top plate, but all it is really is two brackets on the bottom that just bolt to this upper plate. Now, it just goes on here just like this. I have taken the padding off. And what I did is so I can still use it as a body panel uh, work stand, I've just basically slit the bottom of it and so when I need to I can just pop it back on over this. So, 
so this piece is your weld table and like I said this is a cut and weld station that they've basically developed around these stands that you probably already have and the way that that works is one side of these attaches to this piece the other side just basically sits on it so it's got these little pieces that go on the bottom just like that and so when you need to weld you can use this as a welding table when you don't need it it slides right down out of the way and if I'm not mistaken the cut table can also mount on here and it can easily be swung up and mounted in place so you can go from cut to weld very fast let's get that one out of the box and check it out Just like the weld table, the cut table also has these U-shaped brackets on either side. One side mounts, the other side just hangs. And basically by just briefly looking at the instructions, because I haven't read anything, it looks like you mount one of them on this side, you mount the other one on this side, and that way they can swing out of the way of each other. So, let's try that. Alright, so there you go. There is the cut section for plasma cutting. You put your material on here. You can plasma cut through. All these sparks and pieces fall through. It's a great cutting table. And if this thing works as great in theory as I think it will, you can basically just lift up the cut section, swing it down, lift up your weld section, slide it over, and there you go. You got a weld table. And, if you have a shop like mine where you don't have that much space, you can take this piece, fold it down, and then guess what? You can pack it up, go stick it away somewhere until you need to use it again. I must say this is a phenomenal idea that I would have never thought about. Definitely give Eastwood a thumbs up for coming up with this. It's a... Uh, pretty pretty nice tool matter of fact it's actually even cooler now that I get to use it it really really makes sense once you get your hands on it versus just seeing it in the catalog All right guys, there you go. The cut and weld table by Eastwood. You know how this works. I'm gonna put some links in the description. Go check them out, see if it's something you think you might want. As always, I'm gonna try to get you guys to support Eastwood as much as I can because they support the channel. I think this is a great tool. I wouldn't bring it to you if I didn't. So uh, go check it out. And I've got another one that I might do tomorrow or the next day, but it's coming soon, so stay tuned for that. You also don't want to forget that Eastwood is gracious enough to offer you guys free shipping on any orders over 50 bucks. Just use the coupon code, the Fab Forums. It's not just on this, it's on any order that you might make with them. I think they're going to do that through the end of the year, but uh, maybe we can get them to extend it. As always, thank you for joining me. I'll see you guys some more this week. Go do work, son.